Hi, it's San Diego injury attorney Mark Blaine, and the question of the day is, can the government force you to wear a facial covering in public? And the quick answer is yes. Yes, they can, but it's done through police powers of the state through the 10th Amendment. You see, in America, we live in a government that has checks and balances for everything. And so what the federal government has is confidence in its people to manage themselves, especially when it comes to things of public welfare, safety, and health. So with a national pandemic, worldwide pandemic, constitutes a national emergency, the federal government gives power through the 10th Amendment to the states to regulate that for its citizenry. And so here in California, Governor Gavin Newsom made it a requirement to wear facial coverings when you're in public, usually in indoor places where uh, you can't socially distant. Right now I'm in a park, but there's no one around, so I don't have to wear the facial covering. So there is a limitation in the requirement and there all are also uh, exceptions to the rule. For example, if you have a medical condition and you can't wear a facial covering, you're not required by the uh, governor mandate to wear a facial covering. Uh, if you're under the age of two, you're also exempt. You don't have to wear a facial covering. And then, of course, if you're in a public restaurant, cafe, or bar, and you're about to eat or drink, you don't have to wear a facial covering. So there are exceptions, limitations to the scope of the power, but again, the power is derived through the federal government through the 10th Amendment, which is part of our Bill of Rights. Now remember, enforcement of the facial mandate to wear a face mask in public is no different than seatbelt laws for people who are riding in cars and in vehicles or limiting when and where people can smoke. All of those issues still go to, uh, to regulate the health and welfare and safety of the citizens of the state. Fun fact. Bill of Rights uh, 1 through 10 were all ratified and enforced to become law of the land in the same year, 1791. So it, it's basically the first 10 of the amendments of the U.S. Constitution limit the control that the, the government has on its uh, people, uh, on their civil liberties. So there is a balance. Now if you don't wear a mask and you're in public and you're in California, it is a misdemeanor. Uh, so you don't want that to happen. You also want to be safe for others, especially those who are more susceptible to the COVID. So hopefully that answers the question that the government has the power to do that. If you have any other questions you want me to answer, please reach out to me and I'll be more than happy to do that. In the meantime, stay strong. Hey, I hope you enjoyed that quick video on whether or not the government can force you to wear a facial covering in public. Remember, I am an injury lawyer, and so all my cases I help people with is against the insurance companies to get settlements that they deserve. So if you've been injured, or if you know someone who's been injured and needs help, I got free resources on my website. I got ebook downloads, legal survival, survival guides. Just go to blainlaw.com. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, YouTube. I got a great resource of uh, articles on my website to help you make an informed decision on what you need to do next on your injury case. So with that in mind, thank you and have a great day. Bye-bye.